Hey guys, welcome to a complete web application step by step tutorial. I'm Ripon Dutto. In this module, I'm going to show you how to style the content using Bootstrap. So, let's get started. Alright, so first of all, I need to make sure that I have added the reference, which is, I mean, I have included the Bootstrap. Um, CSS files so uh, in this case I didn't see anything that so I need to add new good package the new good package I need to add bootstrap then install Alright, so our bootstrap is installed now. As you can see in the content folder, we have bootstrap theme and other CSS files. So, first go to the layout view. In the layout view, first add two CSS one is bootstrap CSS or in this case I can add bootstrap mean then uh, let's say bootstrap theme okay so first create a div for navigation so class equal never then never dash inverse then role equal navigation okay so in the Neighbor, I need to add anchor tab and class is neighbor brand href is let's say Um, this one, I mean the current page or home page, I will add it later. So, our application name is uh, like online shopping store. Okay, so this is basically our nav bar or navigation bar. Now, let's create the body or container so this is a row and panel if you have no idea about the bootstrap classes you have to search it in google so what is row panel and never never inverse i want to divide the content body into two column first column is for the categories and second column is for the um, body content so I need to create two division one is for let's say categories and the column size with is call Three size and I have another column which is basically um, for example seven this is for our uh, body 
so I need to add the render body here so render body all right now let's run it and let's see all right uh, as you notice there is an error so sometimes it may happen in your case so in this case how to solve it so go to the properties then select MBC right click go to the properties then copy local to true right then run the application again here you go as you can see so this is our uh, application name online shopping store and this is our body and this part this column is for categories and all those uh, contents are styled by bootstrap so this is our navigation I mean page number page 1 page 2 okay now go to the list view so this is our list view I want to make this view I mean I want to style this view so division class equal well then this is I want to make it as a strong okay and I want to remove the heading okay and even this one also in this case I want to use a span so the span class this is basically you know label and level primary and I want to add another CSS class which is full right okay and I want to make another span here class let's say lead okay now run the application again control f5 yes so our this is our application is the problem okay so let's go to the visual studio uh, we can make a is tree tag for name and um, price right now let's see excellent so this is our page now okay or you can design it as you want you can change it using bootstrap or other css whatever you want in this demo purpose i'm just adding some css classes for uh, i mean to display in a nice way all right 
and one thing I want to display the links in the as a button group and it will be displayed in the right that means pull right controller 5 so our menu is in the right side okay so i hope you enjoyed this lesson i mean how to use bootstrap in your application and there are a lot of other classes in the bootstrap framework you can use it you can learn um, from the bootstrap documentation just uh, google it for the documentation then you will see a lot of other classes for user friendly thank you very much for watching this tutorial in the next module i will show you how to create your partial view and how to render it in your body so see you soon in the next tutorial till then bye